Good, how are you doing? Good, doing good. Hey, how are you doing? Good, reading. Hey, how do you pronounce the name of that lens? Fresnel. Fresnel. Okay. okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. A beautiful uh, lighthouse, huh? Yeah, yeah, they've done a nice job restoring it. Yeah. I but, can't, I don't take any credit for that. You but, don't, you should. Well, I, I came <laughs> along after they finished re restoration. But, but, but <laughs> nobody would know you got a mask on in there. <laughs> <laughs> no, good, but they did a good job, you're right. Yeah. Lots of history in this room, too. Yeah. Incline, so it's not straight up and down. Mm, okay. uh, and you're more than welcome to go up there if you want and then tour the house. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>
This is where the lens was. Did you see the lens in the gift shop? No, no. we'll go see it. Okay. Next. So, this building right here with the big high roof mm -hmm. is where the lens is. Okay. They have like the tour on mine. Oh, cool. Read it. You want me to read that? Okay. The head keeper and his family resided in the main house, and the two assistant keepers lived in a separate okay. duplex east <laughs> of the main house. Their duty was to maintain the light, to make sure it burned. I guess they let anybody up here. Um, back in those days, they used oil. You more room up there? Uh, not, not yeah, up there. Yeah, yeah, come on up. Well, yeah, I guess we have. We can yeah, squeeze up. It's just uh, watch your step because there's a hole in the floor. <laughs> Yeah, come on up. Yeah. The more the merrier. <laughs> just uh just watch that's, the hole that's in the, the floor. Uh, the air conditioning. Yeah. Yeah. I want this job. Yeah, really, huh? Oh wow. Up in Crescent City they'll let you do it. Really? Yeah, you can get online and Registered to become a docent up there. Oh, cool! Man, well, it's a really cool a retirement job. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you know. Thirty days at a time, and then they rotate out. Oh, I oh, would wow. do that. They know a oh, lot wow. of stuff too. Yeah. We've done the hike with them. Really? Them. It's really yeah. They know a lot. Cool. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Nice I'm gonna uh, step over. I'll there. see if I can get down. Just jump. jump. <laughs> You heard him stand? Just jump. <laughs> <laughs> That's the fastest way. <laughs> Steep stairs. Huh. It's not here, though. <laughs> that we have purchased to make it look like 1890. Sure, nice. sure. Cool. Very cool. How you doing? Good, how are you? How's the music out there? You know, we just heard a little bit of it oh, before okay. the, the uh, break, so... Good. We just got here, pretty much. Great. We're checking out the lighthouse first. Feel free to walk through upstairs. There are three oh. bedrooms. And then you can always go through the tower. <laughs> Electric to make a beacon. So the house wasn't needed as a residence to keep the fire burning 24 hours. That's why you have lighthouses and for 24 hours is they had a flame that was in the Fresnel lens. Once electricity came here, the bulb took the place of that. And then the whole Fresnel lens was changed to a beacon type system. And now we have the new system on top of the tower. There is an LED that you unscrew and put in a new one if it breaks. <laughs> and that's the new light. And that light actually reaches 17 miles, just like the one up in the tower. Wow. Awesome. How many miles? 17. Wow. On certain days, it's closer because of the fog and everything. But yeah. like today, it's pretty clear. <laughs> So the house has been restored. The furniture here has been replaced because at one time it was abandoned. But feel free to wander around, take a look at what it was like in 1890. Wow. If you have any questions, I'm around so that you can show. That's how it started, yeah, 1890. It was a kid house shipped up from Santa Barbara because there was nothing here. And there was no Avalon. And so, 
Stagecoach. Well, he was standing right there. 